What's up, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Monday. My Rodney, go. <laughs> <laughs> hey. <laughs> Come on! All right, so at work this week, I don't know why. I think one of these nights in this past week, I had a certain thought. Like I've had the same walk for like this is ever. about walking. The same walk. I thought you had a walk. great story to okay, share. And this so, is about walking. So like, <laughs> like I got something, guys. I finally thought of one. This is one a story foot in front of, of the walking. other. Well, no, no. I like, finally figured it out. I had the same like, like I walked the same, you know. So I thought we mostly do. I, so I was like, like at work, and I was like, well, what if I like try out different walks, you know, like try. <laughs> This try is to so like, a Rodney thing. <laughs> Let me see if like I can change my walk at thirty years old. See if I'd like something a little better. I've been at work like all week, really, like walking around like differently, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> like on the way to breaks and shit. Like, cause I mean, when I go to break, I love to it's see like it I'm kind of by myself a little bit. But uh, yeah, I'll try like different. Dude, there's some walks where like hideous, and I just what do you do? I start <laughs> can laughing. You demonstrate? <laughs> I mean, there's no way to demonstrate. Can, you can just see his like big like Bigfoot looking ass like walking by. <laughs> I can quick. maybe do like a little video sometime this weekend of like. Seven different or eight walks. different walks that I'm trying <laughs> out, <laughs> and maybe have a vote. And see are, you, which one. are you trying these out for Jamie? For me? No, pick? I'm just uh, maybe like maybe it's at, time to change at, my walk. <laughs> it's at 30, 30 years, years old, dude. He's like, let me see, dude. If there's just something that benefits me a little more. <laughs> it's not about benefit. I just I want to see if I can like learn to walk differently. Like, do I have to walk the same the rest of my life? <laughs> It just does. Start walking like Gabriel and Malignant. Oh my God, that'd be uncomfortable as shit. Is He's that like, was that your story, try. Rodney? Yeah, yeah, that was. Yeah, I just thought. All right, everybody, that was Monday. <laughs> this is what I was thinking about this week. I had a story, but guess what? I don't remember it. I was saying that right before I was going into this. I'm prepared for. It. Yeah, this one. You were actually prepared to tell us about your walking habits. Uh, have you ever thought of like maybe just like giving up walking, like, just wheelchair it around? <laughs> you know, no. might want to try that next. You've never like sat back and like thought like something that you've done your whole life. Maybe switch it. Like, like why not switch your walk? Like, <laughs> All things. Like, it's probably you know different <laughs> things. You know, like I'm drinking an O Duels. I was like maybe I shouldn't. You know, drink. Like two, three times. Well, I'm saying, like, hang on. Have you ever thought you drink the same way every time too? Oh, I've changed my drinking since when I was a kid. When I when I would drink out of a bottle, when I was a kid, I would put my whole mouth (laughs) on the thing and just like gulp it. You just my brother. (laughs) No, no. I thought you were like I just would go down to the label, get down to the label. I was just having my lips around the whole top. But you have to touch my lungs every time. My brother called me out on it one time, and he was like, "I can't remember. I was young, but he was like, bitch me out for it.' So I and." Told me the right way to do it. We just, I put my top lip in the <laughs> middle of it, and it's like, like that's. I'm you said this was like a year ago. This, this no, I was like a kid. Like I was like eight or nine. I was still living in Florida. So you're not at nine years old. You figured out how to drink properly. <laughs> I think kids do that when they're like sucking on their mom's tit. Rodney found out at ten years old how to properly <laughs> sip a drink. I just yeah, you know, like and just change, just change it. Just, I mean, now see if maybe I had something that drastically dumb, I'd maybe would question everything. I'm like, you know what? Thinking back on that story, maybe I should change it all. <laughs> Who knows what bad habits I've, you know, started up? I mean, the habit of walking, I could be doing that very poorly. I'll do, I'll do different walks in like Walmart and shit, and Jamie will get mad. She'll, <laughs> yeah, she'll, she'll be like, "Stop it!" And I'm just <laughs> like, oh, "Okay," because sometimes I get like, oh, "Okay," I have this like thug walk that, <laughs> that I do, where where like, I'm like, a, like a little pimp, you know. But I like can't go extreme <laughs> with it. So and yeah, it's I'm not gonna stick with that one. But <laughs> well, that I'm sounds like something good. we do in like a Walmart or Target back yeah. in the day. As kids joking. But you're making it sound like you're like, I'm just trying to incorporate this for real. <laughs> yeah, I'm just trying to find, like, a different... I don't what if you could do this to the point where, like, you end up losing your natural walk and you just have a weird incorporation <laughs> of, like, 15 different walks? Like, you're, like, bow-legged, <laughs> and then I know where you're, like, walking really still, and I know where you switch to, like, hood shit, and you're like... 
what the fuck is wrong with Friday? Everybody has a different walk. Yeah, so now that like, would be a really different one. Like he walks okay. fifteen different ways. Do you so ever I can't like? Help it. You ever rate people's walks? You know, what? Like, I thought you said you ever rate people. He's got no. an eight overall <laughs> walking <laughs> style. <laughs> that guy's no, got a four. <laughs> no, but like there, you got to admit though, like especially you when it comes critique. to like the females, like a walk can like mean a lot of shit like if they walk yeah, weird they could be like really hot but if they walk weird it's like a oh okay and you're not a female so <laughs> i'm not a female <laughs> right. so no i'm not saying i'm saying like that's what like i just want to change i just want to change you need to have a different walk for every hairstyle you have like when you shave your head again shaved Don't head rodney ideas, it's dude. this walk <laughs> Don't do raggedy that. i just woke up rodney has a different walk I got. I used to have the Joaquin Phoenix walk, where he because he like swings his shoulders when he walks, but he like <laughs> his chest, you know, is like real, I can't do it anymore. But like, just so you've like, been practicing this for a long time. <laughs> no, like, I'm gonna come clean. I've been doing this my whole life. <laughs> I try to make it a little less embarrassing. Like I just started doing this on a whim. I've been doing this my entire life. I've honestly never paid attention to people's walks that much, unless I have like cerebral palsy or something where I'm like oh that's noticeable but if you're just walking I'm never like look at that walk over there <laughs> yeah, I, don't walk. Notice I don't really do that either though I'm just saying, like literally really just analyzed it that much I don't know it just seemed like something I might try to do is just change the walk and it's <laughs> there's so many like big things you could do in life and fix like it's my face out yourself. there trying to like cure AIDS, you know, like great things. Rodney's like, like imagine that at a party. Like you're at some like fancy <laughs> fucking party. Like Robert over here is trying to uh, cure HIV. And Jamie's like, my husband's trying to relearn how to walk. <laughs> so I'm people think you had a stroke. <laughs> you're like, you're like relearning. I'm you're over there just like <laughs> to improve. Looks like walking. you just woke maybe, up. Yeah, maybe like, just to improve it. I don't. I don't know. Like I tried the pigeon toed walk. That that one's uncomfortable. I tripped over my, my own toes on that. You done like the gorilla walk? I can walk on all. He kick a gorilla's ass, no, dude. I, He's not no, trying to look like one of those weak. I bitches. do. Uh, this that's TMI. I can't do that. But oh, let's hear it. No, no, this not is TMI Monday Mayhem. Mayhem Monday. <laughs> <There's a laughs> huh? Jamie gets Spit upset. Spit it out, sir. Sometimes <laughs> <laughs> we'll be like. You know, make it out or whatever. Oh, like, what'd you say? Like, so I like raise up above real quick and have like <laughs> both fists like side by side on her on the bed, and then I'll just jump back and then hit my chest <laughs> and come back, and then like give her some weird ass look. She gets so mad. <laughs> I'd be pretty mad too. She gets so <laughs> if Rodney's making out with you yeah. for sure, <laughs> that'd be rough. Um. Yeah, there's some. Yeah, I had to talk to her first. Yeah. So there's some stories I can you tell. Right, man. You do trip this dude. Right. Yeah, it's you, so you got some curtains. But then no shave. November's coming up. So yeah, what you, am I gonna like, you got a month. Trim that, dude. Oh yeah, it's <laughs> October first. Yeah, by the time that month's over, dude, you'll you're learn how to have, walk. You're gonna anything. have to like lift the sunroof just to fucking eat, bro. Like, it does suck. Is like when I eat, I go shoe like, on him. <laughs> I've done that before, and know what happens when I do that? I'm like, it's time to shave. Yeah. Rodney's like, I'm gonna just. Grow I, it's it a out. month away from November. He's over just munching on. The it. worst is when you like pull a hair out while chewing, like you get excited yeah. to eat like a chicken nugget, and you you know toss it back, and then you yeah, bite a hair and pull it out, and you're like, fuck. Yeah, and then you but, swallow it. No, you still chew the nugget. Yeah, I know. Just you deal with the pain. Yeah, because who doesn't like nuggets with a side of facial hair? You know, that's just like the perfect seasoning. Especially dino nuggets. You can't waste dino nuggets. See, he's legit. He's Speaking legit. of hair and food, if you all are at a restaurant and there's a hair in your food, do you freak out to where you won't eat it? No, or will you no, pick I, the hair out and eat it? Well, I make them take it back and make me a new meal. I'm real particular I don't give a fuck. That. I'm pulling that hair out and finish him out. Oh, no. Yeah, dude, I'll that tell you this. Me up, dude. Have you know. ate asshole before, Rodney? Huh? <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> Have you ate asshole before? Yeah. But you're not going to eat the remnants of a hair? I don't know that fucker. That hair could have came <laughs> from an asshole. <laughs> There's no way. No. You've had way nastier stuff in your mouth than... They and you're not even putting the hair in your mouth. You're pulling it out. And you're they like, say an continue. asshole is cleaner than a dog's mouth. I don't think that's right. I think it might be backwards. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thinking. Just like you're fucked up walking. Dude, no, we went, we went to Longhorn on Outer Loop one night. 
And uh, and dude, it was the only steakhouse that was like available like now. Like everybody else was like an hour away. Oh yeah. So I was like, well, I haven't had Longhorn in a while, and they have that fucking chocolate uh, cake or something. No, dude, it's more what than that. It? It's called a the chocolate ice cream something, on it? dude. Yeah, That's it's what massive. Goes fire. The a la mode or de la mode. Oh, we got there, fuck. and our Fudge. waiter come up to the table and mm-hmm. asked, you know, what we wanted to drink or whatever. This man is like, mm-hmm. you know, he's overweight or whatever, but pouring sweat, sweat? <laughs> just pouring sweat dude just like chilling like with his notepad like sitting there like we are, what do we want to drink and i'm just i'm looking at him like I, that's getting like, any food well, for sure. so we ordered our drinks and i looked at her and i was like dude can we go i was like i don't want to be here anymore if that's going to be our waiter Wait i don't want to be here he's we like, left you get like leaning over with your sprite and he's like and there's your dude, sprite he, no he did it's like slow motion he leaned with horror in, music like when he put our drinks down on the table he i was watching him i didn't care about my drink i was just watching him and dude sweat was rolling so you got down to, his face you gotta tell the story of home run burger okay <laughs> Meanwhile, while you're looking up oh, here, yeah. he's just stirring your drink with his dick. <laughs> yeah. He's like, dude, dude, dude. And you're just like, okay, no sweat got in. Well, he brought us a drink. So he was like, you need more time. He was like, yeah, and we left. So, yeah, I've done that though, like where I've had hair in my face. Have you ever like been eating food and you're like, is that a? And you're like, and pull a long done, ass hair. Yeah. Like that ruins a meal. For it me. sucks. I'm like, no. We're in the mess. At or work if you and can't shit. get it and you know there's a hair and you're like, where'd it go? And you're like, did I swallow it? I can't <laughs> find anymore. And you're like, oh. See, it doesn't gross me out. <laughs> Dude, hair no, that, me out in general. that home run deal though. That yeah. I'm, that I'm glad I'm over. Or she's gone now, or whatever happened. But dude, I wouldn't eat there for the longest <laughs> time. It was like, why, Rodney? The people want to know. I, it makes me sound like such an asshole. Which you are, but, but it's okay. <laughs> we all are. <laughs> but but the, you know the truth is, she's like, she freaked me out. Too. Like it, it just like I walked up. You know, I wanted to order some food, and <laughs> she had like a mole slash like cleft lip. Upper lip, which a cleft lip is fine, you know, but like the mole that was there was like, oh, this is extra. I can't Man. deal. Like, I don't even want her to like ask me what I want to eat. <laughs> You're afraid the and mole was going to jump on I don't burger. know what, like, I just felt. I she looked know, like I, one of the people from Wrong Turn. No, yeah, like, yeah, well, not, not yeah, that yeah. bad. No, it wasn't that no, bad. No, yeah, so but. the whole time you're walking away, you're like, has a cliff. Like, I <laughs> I'm like, wow, dude, that's awesome. No, but then the dude. whole time she's talking to her friends, like, did you see that motherfucker's fucked up walk? <laughs> like, she's making fun of you too. <laughs> she's like, God, what an idiot. Yeah. And then y'all that's come back to each other, like, thanks for the food. <laughs> and she's just like, thank you. Yeah, I didn't eat there for a long time after that. Yeah, that. Well, yeah, and when we went back, they were all wearing masks. And you were like, that stare, does help you were a lot. like staring at her, and that's when Brandon brought it up. He's like, "You staring at her, trying to see if she's got a cleft lip." <sighs> I don't know what it was. Dude. It was, it was bad. I, it I mean, scared I it was. me. It was dude. a cleft lip. <laughs> it wasn't just that. There was a mole right, there. Right, right. Like the cleft lips are fine. It's just the added mole. There's just a mole fine, huh? You said just a cleft lip's fine. If she just had a mole, is that fine? On her lip? No. So it's the mo- <laughs> it's a mole. <laughs> it's everything. Not when it's I'm like, sorry, your whole fucking face. Not when it's face like coming to like food horrible. and like her like. What's so the mole bad. gonna do? <laughs> huh? What's, do you think she rubs it on your burger? Dude, you don't like awesome I know, powers. I know that like mold. Warts, warts, and pimples get itchy. So mm. a mole, dude. I'm sure if she's just like before I walk in, she's like, "Oh, what can I get you?" And then here's my cup. And here you go. And now I'm drinking mold. She picks sprite. it up like this. Mold sprite. I can't. <laughs> I can't yeah, do it. Yeah, and she goes to give you your drink, and yeah. she does this. <laughs> <laughs> My germs. <laughs> just fucking reaches inside <laughs> of it. Like <laughs> yeah, I just could. Yeah. She's got to itch her lip. She's like, there you go. <laughs> I won't apologize for it, but I'm just saying, like, it... I can't help that I feel like you look like a dumpster fire. I'm sorry. He <laughs> <laughs> looks like he just woke up. It's so horrible. Yeah, I know. He's I been know. trying to learn how to walk, and it's stressing him I out. I worked, and then Rodney's I... Rodney's basically living the life of an infant. He's trying to figure <laughs> out what things are on people's faces, figure out this whole life, figure out how his feet work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I know how the feet work. I just need to know. When he's, when he's uh, having a moment with Jamie, he doesn't know how to just, like, kiss her and have, like, a normal time. He's got, Slash like... Slash gorilla. He just turns into kid mode, like, random gorilla move. <laughs> like, it's just... He's just a little child. He doesn't... Uh, yeah, that's... Yeah. Uh, I might be a little immature. <laughs> but it's okay, bit. though. 
A little it's bit. It's okay. Want we'll to smoke this underage, man? Okay. Has it been lit the whole time? Yeah, this whole time it has been lit. So I don't think you've smoked it once. <clears throat> you seem very wide-eyed. Did you see a cleft lip, lip girl <laughs> look into the window? <laughs> Brandon, we should come in episode with She's cleft right lips. She's right there, like... <laughs> like <laughs> No. And there's another thing that we're going to have a certain person come in as, but that's the thing we can't discuss. Well, you, can, you love confusing Ronnie, don't you? Yeah. It's a, a transformation, if you will. Oh. Uh, we're going to go there. Let's change I, we, the subject real quick. <laughs> <laughs> really, Let's go on it I want on everything I love to release that video to the public, <laughs> but it just, it's, it's too offensive even You for can't us. even tell them about <laughs> this video. The of origin of it. <laughs> <laughs> Like, there's no point in you. Yeah, I like teased it. We could still get some laughter out of it. I, I sent it to certain people, and they were like, dude, you got to air that. They're like, on second thought, no. We'll be <laughs> canceled do pretty yeah, quickly. Real quick. <laughs> Maybe we're early enough, but it's one of those things. It's like you see these, like, sports guys, like, this tweet you made years later. in fucking, <laughs> this tweet you made in high school about mm-hmm. black people. It's like, it was a joke. Like, yeah, obviously you don't want to go there, but damn, dude. Like, uh, I'm pretty sure he's matured. But I'm not joking, I've done though. some stupid stuff about black <laughs> people. I, no, no. <laughs> I was like, God, dude. What the video's just... about, I'm not joking in the video, <laughs> and I will never change my view. Yeah, dude. You say uh-huh. that. You stick to what you know, unless it's walking. Yeah, I will. T- sure. <laughs> I'll change the walk. I can't change my... My mindset on certain things, but walking, I can always do that. Like, from now on, the rest of my life, Oreos go in the fridge. I can't just have Oreos from a cabinet anymore. No. Like, chocolate pudding, like that. snack packs, have to be in the fridge, in the, in the bag. Fridge. I don't want yeah. anything to do with that. <clears throat> you know something you need to start putting in the fridge? I don't actually don't know if you drink it or not, but your Pepto. Semen. Oh, sorry. Put your Pepto Bismol <laughs> in the fridge. No, I don't even know what Pepto is. Oh, you don't? Okay, I that's how you Isn't say. that the stomach ache shit? I use it for heartburn. I remember the commercials where they showed like this big white round pill go down the like the. Uh, it's a pink liquid. It just goes. Well, they might have pills, but it's a pink <gasps> liquid. Yeah, what really goes in the fucking fridge? Milk is, is yeah that for sure. People Rodney put probably bread in the fridge. Yeah, it's always weird. It's grandma's. That's who does it. I remember going to my grandma's house. I'm like, so we're having hot dogs. She's like, I forgot. To defrost the bread, <laughs> <laughs> and it's like what? <laughs> I open the freezer, there's just stacks of hot dog buns and shit. Like it makes them last longer. Like grandma, we about to eat all those right now. It's a fucking cookout. There's no need for this. Yeah, old people do weird things. Um, what really goes in the fridge though is Reese cups, dude. Reese cups cold is Snickers, chronic beyond belief. Snickers is good, dude, but Reese's that hard edge. From the fridge, and mm. I do not eat caramel. Caramel. Well, that's I not in Reese's. Caramel. Yeah, it is. Caramel is peanut butter and chocolate. I forgot. I thought you were talking about. You think that Snickers. combines? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Snickers. I was you, thinking you think Snickers. You peanut butter and chocolate <laughs> combines into caramel? No, but I, I, I don't think peanut saying. butter and chocolate. I don't think Reese's are good either. You're insane. The it's fuck the perfect do you eat? Kit Kats are delicious. <laughs> Crunch bars. They're delicious. Overrated. And then the chewy sprees. Those are delicious. Yeah, the sour ones. Are Ugh, I hate. So you don't like Milky Ways. Uh, Nothing with yeah. caramel. I'm a milk chocolate, not even dark chocolate. I'm a milk chocolate. I can't, I what about like uh, Three Musketeers? They're good. Oh, I love Three Musketeers. Yeah, I do like those. I always thought I couldn't eat them because they were just for women growing up. Oh, dude. Because they marketed a hardcore to the women. Did they really? Yeah, that's all my the mom, commercials. I got were. it from my mom. Like she well, used to eat them all the time, and then I ended up. I thought it was a sissy candy bar. Yeah, for the dude. longest time. <laughs> like, miss me with that sissy shit. <laughs> it's like, bro, it's good. three musketeers. I'm pretty sure they're, like, up. the only ones, too, that come in, like, two in a pack. Where, like, Twix? Reese's, yeah. we oh, were yeah. just talking about. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, shit, a lot of candy bars. <laughs> That's everything. Take five? So you don't like take five? No, Why don't you take that. five minutes and get the fuck off the show? <laughs> take five is good. Nah, well, I, I, Kit Kats are the exactly best candy bar. Good. Have you ever had a whatchamacallit? Those are uh-huh. actually really good, but they're low key. No, that's not payday's? the name of the candy bar I'm I don't talking like payday. about. Paydays are good. Mm. 
I don't understand the concept of putting peanuts on top like, of a candy bar. <laughs> See, this is it's the thing. Great. People, this is why your brain is backwards. People don't try to understand <laughs> concepts of candy bars. <laughs> no one ever says. I don't You're understand about to eat this. The concept of you're this about to consume candy bar. this product. You, you have to understand what it is you're consuming. Yeah, but it's like a quick, like, oh, it's nuts on some caramel. Let me it's an immediate in my alarm. And then in you my eat head. it. You mm. were like, do I eat this? What will come of this? Like, it's like, bro. I mean, if I, you act like you're eating something from the fucking jungle or something. It's not going to kill you. No. You know, there's maybe, spider legs in every candy bar. Maybe a girl bar. with a cleft lip designed the, the candy bar and made it. <clears throat> do what? He's uh, clearing his throat me? over there. <laughs> 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 what was, uh, you said you had trivia? No, not trivia. I got some would you rather's if you want to discuss those. Oh, God. Let's get on the. Oh. Uh, I'd be so bad. Like, would you rather <laughs> eat a pear or a oh. grapefruit? Oh, please don't make me. Neither, <laughs> neither please. Tyler <laughs> just sent in his scores for all the screen movies. Ooh. Should I read those? Yeah, you should. Shit. Uh, his. Worst the best. Least favorite, <laughs> Scream 2. He gave it an 8. Wow. That's his least, though? That's awesome. Yeah, so Tyler said he was dropping the bomb because somehow Next. after a year, an over a year <clears> of doing this, he finally understands what objective and subjective It's going to really <laughs> surprise <laughs> <Okay>. you. <laughs> I was like, his, I've explained this a million times. Tyler. His list is going to surprise you. Yeah, because he's, he's now grading them as his enjoyment. Number three will be Scream 3 with an 8.1. His second favorite movie... Scream. Scream with an 8.3, and his favorite was Scream 4 at an 8.4. He said every cast was stacked, very entertaining, the whole movies. I thought he said he was giving out his first nine. I guess he was joking. So he didn't give Scream a fucking Scream was 8.3. We almost got four nines. Uh, But I got some would you rather. Let's see. Uh... Would you rather? Would you rather? You ready, Rodney? Yep. Would you rather have all dogs try to attack you and kill you when they see you, or all birds try to attack you and kill you? Dogs all day. I've seen the birds. I don't (laughs) fuck with the birds, no. I'm choosing birds all day. I'm just going into a spinning back fist. Dude, they're aerial. Here's the thing. You don't... I don't think you understand how many birds (laughs) see you in a day. Dude. You can't go outside anymore. Yeah, yeah, you're fucked. Well, I'm not. I mean, now it is broader. You're saying all. But for some reason, I was literally just think, every dog that sees you tries to kill you. I wasn't looking at it that way. I was just thinking of like a pack of dogs and a pack of birds. No, I'm saying the rest of your life. The rest. Any of dog that sees you tries to kill you, or any bird that sees I you. I choose tries dogs to kill all day. You. It's gonna suck choosing dogs because I love dogs, but I'm. I'll fight a dog, dog. dude. A bird. Even if you punch a bird in the face, you're punching its beak. It's going to pierce you. To me, it's not even about, oh, I could beat a dog, not a bird. It's the sheer volume of birds versus dogs. How many dogs do you actually see in a day versus birds? I've had a bird attack me. Yeah, in your fucking living room. You remember that shit? Yeah, that happened, too. That was rough. I think we talked about that. That was hilarious. Yeah, but anyways, great. I'm going birds. I'm or gonna, no dogs. I, I'm still going to go birds. I'm still going to go birds. And I'll tell you why. Because mm-hmm. at that point, it's so serious. I'm going to be in like a bubble boy type suit. I, oh, I feel boy. like a dog. I'm going to have some type of protective measure. And I feel like it, birds, I can ward them off in whatever suit I design to some degree because they're pecking. A dog will just rip through anything. And then you have like fucking 10 dogs on you just eating you. That's because of the the measures you can take further makes it be, I'd rather uh, it be birds coming at me. How many times have you seen 10 dogs in one setting? The monthly dog shows I go to. All the time? Yeah, dude. If they're after me like that, they're going to be like hopping fences, all my neighbor's dogs and all this shit. Well, he's not saying they will. He's saying saying they want to. If they see you. If they're chained up, they're going to want to try and attack you, but they can't because they're chained up. It's it's not like unrealistic. And that's the other thing is most dogs are contained. Most times you see a dog that's on a leash. It's in someone's backyard. You see hundreds of birds every day. And then there's like thousands you don't see. See, I think... If they want me to the degree that they have to attack me every day, dogs are going to find a way. Because there's sometimes. But the birds will beat you to it. Beat the dogs yeah, to but it. That's where my new protective bird suit comes from. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm saying they'll be. On paper, birds for sure would be worse. But I think <clears throat> if it's that fucking serious where you're going out every day, you would make 
you would take measures in your own hands and you'd be like, let me design <clears throat> something or get something that will protect me from these attacks and dogs are going to get through that easier. Whereas birds, I feel like I could ward them off. And, like, every time I got out of the car, I'd, like, sprint into everywhere. Whereas a dog would just fucking... Like, I'd be inside before I got them, <clears throat> got got away from them and they couldn't get into my shit. One dog could just, no matter what you have, just rip it open. And boom. That, that's my thoughts. You got to bite them. Arr! All right, would you rather no pee yourself in public or shit yourself in private, but you have to stay in your clothes for three hours well, before you clean it up? Definitely shit myself in private. I do that all the time without cleaning it up. I did, I'm at home. But you got to sit matter. in there for three hours. Not three hours now? No, I like to do the whole 24. So it's still shit. No, I'm, I'm that's pissing a myself weird one. in public. Yeah, I'm pissing myself in public. What we I don't talking care here? about the embarrassment. Are we talking about like liquid shits or full on logs in your pants? That does make a difference. So it's. I still think it's pissed. So it's <laughs> it's a it six a inch log and then it's some liquid behind it. It's a plug and then. Yeah, the I'm gonna release. piss my pants in public. I've literally pissed myself. <laughs> I've shit myself in public. Again, <laughs> Ronnie's like, come. come <laughs> I pissed in the back of the police car. <coughs> He's like, I just got these seats clean. I'm like, well, you took too long one. searching my fucking car, bro. I had to pee. I got one kind of relating to media. Would you rather only be able to watch one TV show for the rest of your life, so you can watch it from front to back, or you can only watch the first episode of any TV show? Wait, what? Would you rather watch one TV show and that's it? You can pick any show. You can watch every season of it. Or you can only watch the first episode of, of any e- show. Okay. every show. Ooh. Yeah, that's, I can't. That's a tough one. No, because then I no, getting rid no, of that 70s show. No, no, that's what I was about so to that say. So that was going to be my next question. Well, it wouldn't be. What, what would, would it be? Choose. Well, here's the thing. Originally, I was like, I definitely don't want to watch one episode of a TV show because that's just build up to what's coming, and that would haunt me forever. I definitely would choose my favorite show. But then again, there's a great... if you. Ch- Turn it away. I was thinking like Game of Thrones, Dexter. I'd be like wanting more. But if you change that up a bit, and you know you've already seen those other ones that would suck, but you bring in comedy like that '70s show, Workaholics. It's always sunny in Philadelphia. There's a lot of like rewatchability for those where like the ending doesn't matter as much, to where you could just watch a one-off episode. Uh, no. So you just do one show. And what uh, would your show be? That, that '70s show. show. Yeah, that's I, a good, there's no, that's I would a solid choice. Yeah, I'd probably, I'd honestly, even though that '70s show we did this ranking might be like my fifth. I'd do one show, and it probably would be the replay, like a comedy show. Like it'd probably be that '70s with a show. lot. And they've got everything: drama, comedy, horror, yeah, the Halloween episodes. episodes. Yeah, that might win out due to episodes, but it probably would be like a comedy show, like Workaholics or that '70s show. The only problem with Workaholics though is isn't there only like what four or five seasons? There's seven. Is there seven? Yeah, and every season's only like 10 episodes, but there's a few that are like 12 or 13, and the third season has like 22 episodes. I don't know. It'd be between those two, I think, for me. It's Always Sunny would be in the mix. All right, that's it for Would You Rather. <laughs> oh, nice. Nice. I think I'd go one show, too, and that 70s show would probably be it. It's just too rewatchable, bro. I wish they'd put it back on streaming. It's killing me. I got it on... I know both y'all do. I, I had the whole series too. Wait, you have the pack thing, don't you, Brandon? Yeah, if it's in here, it might be another room. It'd be right there. Those are just random seasons of other ones I collected over time that I've lost. Um, would y'all rather tie a rope around your dick and have a cinder block at the other end of it and drop from a tree? Or would you rather drop from a tree onto a gigantic dildo and a cannonball? <laughs> Jesus, dude. Uh, well, I've, st- I've seen the, the center block one happen in old school. But it's guaranteed that the whole dildo is going up your ass. And it's like a 12-inch oh, dildo. Okay, I was going to say how long. I'm probably going to do the... God, that's awful, dude. <laughs> I just came up with love spot. I don't want either of those to happen, but uh, you I guess the first one would be the one I'd go with. Mm-hmm. I'd probably take the fucking 12-inch dildo up my ass. I'm sorry. I'll tell you why, because if I'm without my dick, 
I don't know if I want to live. That's so fucked up. <laughs> Seriously. Get a robotic one. Th- that's not. I ain't gonna feel the shit. same. Yeah, <laughs> like I'm scared if a cinder block mm. yanks my dick full speed like that. I think it's ripping my dick clean off. I don't think it. Ripped, and then you uh, bleed out. Dudes off in old school. Yeah, I wonder that, why. That's factual. <laughs> Jared Mixon. Uh, dude, what happened to him though is he fell and it went through a fucking like into the sewer. So it was just hanging and he was like stuck to the ground. <laughs> <laughs> Talk about the worst situation ever. Like, how do you even get out of that? It's so bad. God, that would hurt so bad. Wow. I think you would just pass out. Like, yeah, the pain maybe. would be so immense, yeah. At least I would hope so. Yeah. Wake back up. I'm still in here. Like, we literally can't figure out how to get it out, man. We're just thinking about maybe digging around you. We got the fire trucks here. This is embarrassing. Just shoot me. Yeah, dude. TV show? Monday Mayhem. May turkey. You got a lever on you? We got anything else? We wrapping it? Wrapping and tabbing it 30 minutes. That's what you normally do. Unless Tyler's here. Tyler always wants to do like an hour. I respect.